Welcome back to a mortal love letter from the past. I, I am finding things like the number nine. I'm also finding out more about this murder. Our character Jacques, he has been set up for the murder of Angelica. Who is this guy, Pierre? I told Jacques that Angelica was to be married and he went insane. He threatened me saying he'd rather kill her than let her marry another man. Well, that's not true, Uncle Pierre! That is not true! See, see, I'm being framed by my uncle, no less. That's not cool. That, that's not good. That's not good. See, basically, I tried to run away with my girlfriend, Angelica, because she was going to be forced to marry the evil Count. I know Angelica's my girlfriend. I mean, look at her special kiss letters to me. I mean, come on. Jock, forgive me. The prosecutor in a trial confused me and twisted my words. I should have told them about our secret marriage so they won't make me testify against you. I'll find the wedding certificate. Whoa, so I am. I was secretly married to Angelica. Okay. So that's why I was trying to run away with Angelica. She was my wife, but the evil Demorton, DM, I think that's this guy, Demorton, he, he wants Angelica all for himself. So he framed me for kidnapping and murder. So DeMorton's saying, you need to poison him. Whoa. So DeMorton ordered my death and poisoning. Okay. Yeah, I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of here. I don't like this jail. I don't like it. I don't like how DeMorton's running the jail and trying to kill me. Not sure why he's trying to kill me on such a very specific date, but whatever. This is a puzzle. What you want to do is move the key parts around so they all match. So like the shell, the reddish shell goes over here with the shell key. And uh, the green goes with the green. Silver goes with silver. Once you get all the key pieces in place, we can search through here. And awesome, we've got the lantern. Now we can escape. Now we can escape here with the help of our friend, the man in the mask. Who I believe is called Peter. As long as it's not my evil uncle Peter who's giving false testimony, I think I'll be fine. Okay, so my buddy shot a cannon at the prison wall. You there, stop right where you are! Uh, stop! Oh! Okay, that took care of the guards. Woohoo! And it revealed a dead body. That's you. You. Uh, I'll check out the dead body in a moment. But first, I have a blankie. I use the blankie to put out the fire. And I'm taking a look at this. Jacques, come down! There's a carriage for you under the tree. Protect your hands so you don't burn them on the way down. And this is a thingy. This thing we picked up uh, over here, it's basically a collectible thing. So if we find all of these hidden collectibles throughout the game, we'll learn more about the evil De Morton and his evil plans. So we'll learn more about what he's done to all of his wives, especially his first wife, Valerie. This is Valerie. He is punishing her. This amulet will turn back time so you get to relive the last moments of your life forever, Valerie. Ha 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 ha. So he's punishing Valerie. I don't know why. It's probably because he's evil. But I mean, a time traveling device? Awesome. I could use a time traveling device. I could also use those handcuffs. Th those will help me slide down the rope without hurting my hands. What is... Thank you. I'm Valerie, De Morton's first wife. De Morton imprisoned me for disobeying him. He became so angry and cruel. Not the same person I once loved. He used this amulet to make me live the last moments of my life over and over again. Its power to turn back time could be of use to you, though. Use it when you're in danger. Good luck. Thanks, Valerie. We'll definitely see more of Valerie as this game proceeds. She's a ghost now, and 
ghosts are awesome. Okay, sliding down. You let him go! Whoa, is that Demort? No! Please! Find him and stop or share his fate! I'll see to it myself, sir. Looks like Demorton has a has an army of evil evil people who are zombie Oh, that's not good. Okay, so why didn't DeMorton just kill me then and there if he's got evil powers to just kill people whenever he wants? That's a good question, Jock. Actually, our main character has a really, really good point. Okay, so what we want to do here is get some nuts for the squirrel. La 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 la. And this last one. Uh oh. Gotcha! Uh, time travel device, don't fail me now! Okay, apparently the time travel device only takes you back in time, like, ten seconds, but that's okay, that, 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 that's fine. So this time I'm putting a nest down so the final acorn does not fall onto the ground. Okay, now that I have all the acorns, the squirrel will let me through, right? Oh, oh, okay, no, 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 no. While the squirrel is distracted by the acorns, I can explore this area and get a very useful knife. So let me get that knife, because that knife, that is the item I need. I really need that knife item. Finding coins, I'm finding all sorts of things here. Do, 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 to get the lizard. You use the fly on the lizard. Looks like I need a butterfly, a bone, and a coin. I'm not normally this good at hidden objects challenges, but I, I, I've played this game before, so I know where the items are. Okay, I played it 20 minutes ago, and that's how I know where the items are. It's, it's not that I'm really good at remembering, it's that I played it 20 minutes ago. Okay, cool. So I have a net, and I'm just going to throw it down on this dude. No, 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 not the knife, the net. Throw the net. And now we get to go into a carriage with our masked ally. Hi, mysterious man in the mask. Uh, 